My name is Leoba Dume from Faset Missouri District with a poem entitled My Rights. Here I am, an African girl child, with tears that was still flowing like the waters of Musi Atunya. What have I done to deserve this kind of punishment? What more should I expect? They say I am an African girl child and I should suffer for that. Walking long distances to fetch firewood with a baby on my back, crying because he's got a piece of firewood stuck in his eye. And when I get home, there's another child who's crying from hunger. And if the house there's a drunken husband who start beating me up because I did not cook, forgetting that there is nothing to cook in the house. And I'd flee to the headman who is in there, who went to attain another girl child who's been raped by her father. Not once, not twice, but thrice, and the father's always been charged, not guilty. What more should she expect? They say she is an African girl child, and she must suffer for that. But our time is to come, our rise, our future. So let the rise be ours. Give us the strength, opportunity, to speak freely without fear of how we are affected by the way people treat us. If a girl is given the right to participate in everything the community do, believe you me, things will never be the same again. Adults and children, we can make up our country, or even the whole world, if we work hand in hand. So start beating us today, because we are the future and tomorrow's leaders. As it was pointed out, the Ethiopian Tower in France doesn't be demanded, but it took years of hard work and dedication. So stand up, Zimbabwean girl child, stand up. African girl child and fight for our rights. With this, I salute you.